previously on Caitlin's Way. This is the sixth home in two years, Caitlin. You have been difficult to place. She wants you to go live with them. Yeah? What if she steals my stuff or worse? She's just had some tough times. Never lose me. Never lose me. We're your family. I don't need any more families. Hold hard cash on four legs. It's okay, you can trust me. What a freak show! <laughs> High River, a far cry from the big city. In a small town, it's much easier to stick out and much harder to do your own thing. At least my first day of school is over with. Now I can just go to my room and have some time to myself. We're not going home. We're not? You brought the Martian? <sighs> oh, funny. Yeah, I know you. You're that guy who runs the school, right? Well, your life has just changed. No kidding. We've got a fugitive living in our town now. Don't push me. Don't mess with me. <laughs> Are you kidding? It's on! You guys, come on, chill. Come on, you guys. We're just going bike. She's coming with us. I'm not going anywhere with you. We're going to Flat Top Canyon. Mom said I can't go unless you do, so you're going. Lock up your stuff, boys. Eric, be cool. She just got here. Just act normal. Or try to. Just lay off and ride. She rides in the back. It's the bikes. Rip, let's go. So much for time to myself. action for you? You have no idea what action is. You ever had a downhill rush? Look, I've been on a bike before. Okay, how about this? You and me, from the top of the ridge, down to the river. Eric, come on, man, she's never been here. Yeah, she's never ridden on rough terrain. You want to race, I'll race you. I wasn't talking to you. I win. You ride home in the back. I'll see you at the top. Ranchers are taking matters into their own hands. That wolf's got everyone nervous. He's killing randomly now. He's not even interested in eating the livestock. We gotta get the canine patrol, about a dozen extra men, and a chopper up from Butte. Garth, we're looking for a wolf, not an escaped fugitive. Just track him through Longview. I'll head up to Flat Top Canyon. 10-4. Okay, so the race ends when we get to the bottom. How much of a head start do you want? None. None? <laughs> You're making this way too easy. Okay, ready, set, go. <laughs> Gonna put some muscle in it. Yeah! Caitlin, pump the brakes! 
Welcome to High River. I can't stop! Caitlin! got to him. He might be rabid. Run! Run! It was just a tranquilizer gun. Caitlin, I'm sorry, but it was for your own safety. You should actually be thanking him. That horse is rabid. He could have stomped you to death. No. That horse saved my life. Jim showed up late like every other cop. That's enough, Caitlin. And Griffin, don't play up to me. I told you to stay away from Flat Top Canyon. You lied to me. Hey, what's going on? The wolf attacked Caitlin. The buckskin horse showed up. He took on the wolf. Is she OK? Well, physically, yes. Mentally. Griffin, not now. She's fine. Just upset. Hey, I heard what happened. Are you okay? I'm fine, but your husband tried to kill that horse. Come on, Caitlin. He was just trying to protect you. One of the symptoms of rabies is that the animal goes crazy. But that horse saved my life. But if that wolf scratched or bit him... You know what? Ever since my mother died, I've been looked after by so-called sane people who couldn't care less about me. And now that I find something that makes me happy and makes me feel safe, you're trying to tell me that he's crazy? Well, I'll tell you something. I'll take crazy over sane any day. Oh, Caitlin. I'm sorry that you had to go through all that pain. Where's Caitlin? Shouldn't she be helping out with this stuff? Uh, why don't you ask her? I can't find her. I've looked everywhere. Hmm. Oh, no. Excuse me? In words you can understand, get out of my room. Did you know that one of the symptoms of rabies is aggressive behavior? You're foaming at the mouth. Maybe you're infected. Look, maybe you didn't understand the first million times I told you. <sighs> Grow up. Oh, and your password, Griffinator, it's way too easy. And your cyber pen pal, Chang, sent you an email. He says he's sorry you have to live with your crazy cousin. So am I. Dory, I have to find that horse tomorrow. We can do some tests on it and find out if he's okay. Oh, Caitlin, I'm sorry. We can't do that. Why not? You're a vet. There are no tests for rabies. But I just looked it up on Griffin's computer. 
Caitlin, listen to me. There are no lab tests which can confirm rabies in live animals. The animal has to be dead to get a definitive diagnosis. Great, so we're just gonna wait around here until that happens? Where'd you go? I have to make a call over at Peterson's farm, and I was hoping you could help me out. Take Griffin. He's gone with Jim to look for the wolf. Come on, it'll be a great photo opportunity. They live at the edge of the foothills, where the wild horses graze. She sure has got an attitude. You should have seen her face off with Eric. What's that? Looks like a dead mountain goat. Man, she showed no fear, you know. She would have won that bike race if she stayed on the path. Eric would have choked. She probably felt she had something to prove. You gotta remember, Griff, after everything she's been through, she doesn't know how to be just a regular kid. All right, I guess I could find a purpose for her sooner or later. Wolf tracks. And they're fresh. And you long you suck they go that way. You know, Caitlin, this is one of my most favorite spots. You'll be able to get some good shots here. I saw some of your photographs. They're good. They're private. You have no right. I thought that maybe the two of us girls should start. Hey, it's not gonna happen like that, all right? I'll try and stay out of your way, and you try and stay out of mine. Deal? <sighs> no. No deal. Look, I don't want to intrude on your space, but the truth is, you're part of my space now. And we have to learn to share that together. Look, just because you and my mother were some sort of relatives doesn't mean you and I have to like each other. <sighs> Caitlin, I hardly even knew your mother. But I'm sure she'd rather have her daughter with family than with complete strangers. What do you know about her? You didn't even know she was dead until I showed up. I know. I wish I could change that, but I can't. I can't even imagine what you must have gone through. At least your mother didn't suffer. How do you know? She had an aneurysm. She died instantaneously. An aneurysm? You didn't know? I mean, no one ever told me. They just took me away and put me in a home. The stallion's not with him. This will be a breeze. Come on. Let's go get him. Yeah! yeah! Come on! Yeah! I'm gonna give her a vitamin shot and then she's gonna be ready to fall. Thanks, Dr. Lowe. I appreciate you looking after her. Her last birth was real hard. Yeah. Well, you make sure you call me when she goes into labor. All right. All right, now where is Caitlin? She wandered off that way. Either the wolf's wounded or he's tracking a wounded animal. Dead. It's the wild horses. I wonder what's making them stampede. Come on.
You try to keep him away from the hurt, or we'll lose him again. <laughs> I got you now, Buckskin. Wow. Garth, we're at the edge of Flat Top Canyon now. I'll tell Dory. Okay. That's why they're stampeding. Why? Yeah! Come on now! Rustlers. This is so cool. Cool nothing. It's dangerous. And you're staying here. Come on. Doesn't being the sheriff's kid count for anything? Not this time. Stay here. So that's it. You do remember me, don't you? I was hoping I'd see you again. Oh, man. Figures, with this trouble, there's Caitlin. Howdy, boys. Sheriff! Beautiful day. Got a permit for the horses? Ah, uh, no. Yep. No, we don't have no, a permit because don't. their horses uh, technically aren't ours. But they're going to be technically. They're not going to be ours because he, don't listen to him. He's not right in the head. He bit through an electrical cord when he's a baby. That Pride did him. not happen. You just don't remember. It didn't happen. You drove him in the corral. I've been watching you. Well, that's true. Um, no, no. Yes. We did that. Just. Stand together, put your hands behind your backs. What for? Cooperate with them. Okay. My Jeep will do 110. How fast your ATV go? Oh, 30, 40? What's your point? Get over here. Tracking the wolf, you better beat it because I think he's around here. Fine, don't believe me. Why are you so. Ah! Help! Don't you dare move! Way. Real slow. He's rapid. Yeah, I remember. Get out of here! Come on, get behind the rock. Back, 
You can't. I won't let you. Caitlin, he may be rabid. No. I'm staying with him. <sighs> He's awesome. Did you guys see the way he took on that wolf? All right. We can keep him at the ranch, but if he shows any symptoms, he won't. I know it. Is he gonna be okay? Well, I'm not sure yet. Look, I just wanna take care of him. Like he took care of me. Well, Caitlin, just don't get so close to him. I have to run to the clinic for a few minutes if you need me. I don't need you. I don't need anybody. Caitlin? He has rabies, doesn't he? No, if he did, he would have shown signs by now. Really? Mm-hmm. He's yours. <laughs> now we just have to get him registered properly, so no one will ever be able to steal him again. She gets to have a horse? How come I don't get a horse? You have a dog. Yeah, but a horse. Thank you. So much. Now you have two strays. Oh, Caitlin, you're not a stray, you're a gift. You've changed all our lives. Oh, if anyone cries, I'm out of here. Oh, speaking of gifts, here. To replace the one that got trampled. It's got a zoom lens. Let's you zoom in and out. Thank you. <laughs> Here. My new family. The cop, the vet, and the geek. I guess things could be worse. I'm gonna name you Bandit after the wonderful horse in the book my mother used to read to me. You think we should stick around for a while? It's weird. I'm out here in the middle of nowhere, but I don't feel alone. It's different from the city, but maybe that's good. Maybe this is how a kid is supposed to live.